Monroe still here from Fashion Steel NYC and welcome back to my channel and another spend the day in New York City with me vlog make sure to give your girl a thumbs up and subscribe if you love fashion beauty lifestyle and travel videos all right guys I'm super excited y'all know Memorial Day just passed your girl did some shopping um, I actually linked with my girl Janae of Hilo Lux and ran into my girl Karen Brick Chick the other day at Bergdorf's and did some luxury shopping so before we get into the vlog portion of the video where I take you guys with me to an event with the Outnet and then out to dinner at Nobu with my girl Janae of Hilo Lux. I'm gonna show you all of the things, well a few of the things that I purchased yesterday. I have two luxury buys I'm gonna unbox for you all and show you and then I'm just gonna show you everything else that I've kind of gotten since I've been in New York whether that is from shopping the Memorial Day sales, I have a little bit of skims things um, and just some other items that I have purchased. So yeah Without further ado, we're just gonna jump right in, but do not forget your girl is doing an Amazon The Drop collection. It's coming out soon, so if you don't wanna miss it, make sure to click the link down in my description box as well as in my pinned comment. Scroll down to the middle of the page and click the button that says uh, sign up for text or email notifications. You might not see my photo there, but because you're coming from my link and you click that button, it will sign you up for my drop. So yeah, I don't want you guys to miss it. It's only going to be um, shoppable for 30 hours. It is size inclusive. Um, if you've watched my stories, you've seen a sneak peek of the collection. So if you're not following me on Instagram, you're playing yourself, make sure to give me a follow at Monroe Steel. All right, guys, let's go ahead and get started with new things I've gotten in for Memorial Day. We will start with my outfit of the day because everything your girl is wearing is new. Okay, <laughs> except for my makeup. I did my normal face today, just a super quick look. A lot of people ask about my eyebrows. I use Sephora Brow Pencil, I'll link it down below. The lip is Modest Matte by Absolute New York. You can get it at Walmart, I'll link it down below. And my foundation is actually Tinted Moisturizer from Beauty Counter, which is a clean makeup brand. I have a code, MAGIC20, all capital letters, for 20% off of your first order at Beauty Counter. That was a lot. 
by the way i just go ahead and put all of my coupon codes in every pinned comment so if you're like wondering if i still have one check the first comment on every video um i usually put my coupon codes there all right guys so the outfit ah! speaking of amazon y'all this is a top from amazon basics i absolutely love it i have it in white I've worn the white one on the vlog a few times. I also have it in like this kind of like neutral, like a light brown color. Uh, I love these. I got, I always get them in a small um, and they fit great. I'm normally a medium, but these are just so great for summer. A quick little halter goes a long way. So I'll link these down below because I did get the black one and like the brown one. I got those in recently. Now, this fabulous skirt is from Christopher John Rogers, which is one of my favorite black designers. I've been rocking with Christopher for a long, long time. I remember maybe like a few years ago, I did, um, during Black History Month, I only wore black designers and he was so gracious to loan me one of his dresses to wear for that. If I can find the photos, I'll pop it up here. But yeah, like, incredible i went to bergdorf's and they were having a sale and i was able to score this incredible skirt and i love it it has pockets it has so many fun colors in it it has green blue like a nice purple red so i can really pair this with almost like any shoe in my wardrobe today i paired it with my orion sandals that i recently got in this beautiful vibrant green um yeah they have these on the hermes website but you gotta check back at weird times of days just to see if they restock like sizes um but yeah loving this skirt loving this amazon top loving my sandals that is my outfit of the day and of course two new items i got in the top from amazon and the skirt from christopher john rogers i'll be sure to link any other christopher john rogers pieces that i can find online um but yeah this one was on sale so i'm really really glad I scored it. All right, guys, so let's get into the rest of the haul. Um, starting with what I got at Bergdorf Goodman yesterday, I actually headed to Bergdorf's to meet my girl Janae of High Low Lux. Um, and literally, when I walked into the shoe department, Karen of Karen Britchick was there. This was not planned at all. It was so hilarious. I'll actually insert a few video clips here. Um, I actually wore this two-piece Skims set, um, which is a bralette top and shorts. I wore my Chanel dad sandals, an oversized blazer, and my brand new Chanel um, bag from Fashion File, and just a hat. That was like my, I'm shopping and I'm trying to be inconspicuous look. Um, and it's so funny when Janae showed up, Karen, Janae, and I were all wearing Chanel dad sandals, and I have a clip of that. It's so hilarious. We had a good time walking around, shopping. Unfortunately, I did not vlog that, but that's okay. Let me show you what I ended up getting from Bergdorf's. Now, if you watch my stories, you've already seen these. Um, but I got my first ever pair of Saint Laurent shoes. Um, I've been trying to actually purchase anything from Saint Laurent, especially their footwear, um, for years. But I am a U.S. size, like nine and a half, ten. In any like European made shoe, I'm usually a 41. Um, and Saint Laurent shoes run extremely small, you guys. So it was a miracle that I could even find these shoes in a 42. But let's go ahead and get into it. Of course, comes in a beautiful black box with saint laurent there on the front open it up have a little bit of tissue paper both shoes come in a saint laurent dust bag ah! you guys i've been looking at these shoes and i'm so glad i found them these are their heels in mesh so they are black mesh heels they are so stunning and sexy. I haven't had a stiletto like this in years. And honestly, I think stilettos are coming back. Like, stilettos and a pencil skirt is the look. It's the way, it's the future. But as soon as I tried these on and like Karen saw the mommy and Janae, they were like, girl, these are so sexy, so classic. 
even though there's a spin on them with the mesh um, I love that you can actually see my toes through them um, and they're made really really well and although they look very very like uncomfortable they are so comfortable like they just mold to your feet um, the craftsmanship is incredible I got these in a size 42 again I'm normally a 41 the 42 fit perfectly so now i know that i'm um, a 42 in any saint laurent shoe um i feel like they run almost a whole size small but i'm really looking forward to styling these in the summertime with like baggy cargo pants or um denim cut off like bermuda shorts and maybe a black linen top uh, they're just classic and i i'm gonna style them up so if you want to see how they look um, when I style them, definitely give me a follow on Instagram at Monroe Steel. If I can find these anywhere online, I'll link them down below for you all. But I did find these at Bergdorf. Um, and I believe they have them at the St. Laurent store um, on 57th Street in uh, New York City as well. All right, guys. Next up, something else from St. Laurent. Um, Janae and I actually left Bergdorf and we went across the street to the actual St. Laurent store. She wanted to check out if they had something else. If you want to see what she got, you're going to have to go over to her Instagram, her TikTok. Um, it's Hilo Lux <laughs> to see what she got because she got some good stuff. But because we were such good customers there, they gave us this bottle to celebrate, which is really, really cool. So yeah, they gave us a bottle of Louis Roterer um, champagne, which is really cool. We actually drank a, f a few glasses while we were in the store. Um, but yeah, what, sh what a sweet little treat. Um, I've never, I mean, I've gotten uh, champagne before, like by the glass at luxury stores like Fendi, Louis Vuitton, um, and Saint Laurent but never a whole bottle so really excited to have this they actually poured us a few glasses while we were in the store and this is amazing champagne like it's actually really really delicious so shout out to them and yeah I think I'm gonna put this on ice and crack this open later um, okay so <sighs> Louis Vuitton, you guys know I'm a Louis gal. I recently got my planner from Louis Vuitton and then I got my travel cases. Actually, let me show those to you all as well. So in a previous haul or actually in a previous vlog, because I, I tend to show anything I get new in vlogs instead of doing collective haul videos. Um, I recently got Mama, <laughs> which is like a travel um, case and baby. Um, and I love them both. I use them both for my traveling back and forth between Miami and New York. This one is great. I put all of my toiletries in here. This one is great as well. I have like all of my jewelry and perfumes in here. And sometimes I'll wear this as like a little night out bag with an outfit. So yeah, I got these two in recently. And I also got the medium size uh, like notebook as well. Um, this one doesn't have the binder class inside so inside I just have a notebook but actually in here I have a lot of receipts and cards and y'all don't need to see that but yeah recently those were the last three items I bought from Louis Vuitton I don't have any other bags other than my multi pochette bag and so when I saw this y'all I had to get it all right so let's go ahead and I'm quickly unbox this because it is a bag. So I ended up getting the Speedy in the newest latest size this is the speedy 20 it's so amazing i've always wanted the the mini speedy but when i saw that they were coming out with this size i could not resist so this is the speedy 20 
um it's incredible it does have two zippers which i love so that you can open it and close it from either end on the inside it's red there is like one little pocket here as well uh so stunning now it does have hooks on both sides um and it does come with a crossbody strap y'all i hate the crossbody strap why did louis vuitton do that this this don't go it don't go at all luckily i have a strap from my multi pochette that i can pop on here instead because pink and yellow and cream it, that's not doing it for me like i looked at the sales associate and she was just like <laughs> but i love the bag so much i will probably never wear it crossbody anyway so the strap is like not even factor into my decision to buy this i will probably always carry it like this but it's so cute yes it's big enough to like fit on your wrist it's so dainty and like a perfect little night out bag that will actually fit your phone so here i have an iphone 11 pro max fits perfectly like with tons of room to spare so that is why i wanted this size over um the mini but oh uh, the craftsmanship is so beautiful of course it does come with the little lock and key on one side of the lock you have the um louis vuitton symbol and then on the other side it just says louis vuitton paris you have two little keys here i'm in love with this bag um and i'm very very happy to finally have a speedy in my collection of bags like i've always wanted one and this size is it's perfect you guys i am gonna wear this bag so much you guys know i have the matching sandals um the slides i think they're like bomb dia or i'm i'm sure i'm not pronouncing that correctly but that's how you spell it sandals um and it's just great for spring for summer for date nights anytime you don't want to carry a lot uh, i highly recommend it these are selling out like hotcakes this new size um i actually bought the last one they had in the um fifth avenue store so if you see it get it immediately because i think this size is the one she the one let me know what you guys think down below all right guys next up i got a little something from the real real um i actually vlogged this so you may have seen this already but i got this fendi skirt it's been on my wish list for a really long time i'm just so happy that i was able to find it at the real real i mean y'all they be having some good stuff on there especially stuff you cannot find um if you haven't heard about it it's like a luxury designer consignment store but it's online um but yeah how cute is this fendi zuka print skirt i absolutely love it i think it's gonna match perfectly with my fendi uh, zuka print baguette i also have the wristlet from fendi that i think would look amazing with this as well um i'm trying to think do i have any other fendi bags like i have so many i just did a whole video on all of my luxury handbags but yeah love this skirt it has pockets in the back i can just see myself wearing this with actually this top from amazon that i've linked down below for you guys and maybe my black celine boots here are my black celine boots i love these so much i actually got these from bergdorf a couple of years ago um and this and this top for just a cool effortless kind of model off duty type of look i can also pair this with my brand new um heels that i just showed you from saint laurent um just a very versatile skirt and very happy to have it if i can find any online i'll literally search all of like the resellers and such because i believe this is a uh, vintage um i will link any down below that i can find for you guys it does have a little slit in the back to to make it very easy for you to walk in as well guys, let's get into the next portion of the video where i'm showing you a few things that i got for memorial day on sale i did shop the sales the main sale that i shopped honestly was skims now if you don't like kim and you don't like skims just skip ahead maybe like seven minutes to when i take you with me to the outnet event 
otherwise if you want to see the goods let's get into it now you would have seen me wear a stunning like brown silky multicolor hoslet on the left side house dress in my morning routine at the beginning of this video and i know i know you went straight to the description box looking for it yes it's from skims y'all so skims has silk house dresses now this is this is silk it is absolutely beautiful. It has a super high slit on the left hand side, but the way the slit is placed, you can see it's bunched on the inside. It's very strategic in a way that it doesn't show anything. It literally hits you like on your left hip bone. Um, and it's just beautiful. The quality is A1. The straps are adjustable, which is great. And it's just a beautiful silk dress. If you wanna be I don't know if you want to feel luxurious if you want to feel beautiful sexy effortless while you're just at home um this is for you i actually slept in this as well and i slept like a baby um it's very very soft against the skin it does have a little bit of stretch i don't know how to, how they did that <laughs> but it does have a little bit of stretch i'm normally a us size six 28 in jeans i usually get a size medium and everything in skims i always get a small in everything they their sizing is very generous and of course has a little bit of stretch so in this uh silk dress you can size down one size i'll link this down below like i'm pretty sure i sold this dress out already because i wore it on my stories and i immediately posted it do you know how many people clicked that link you guys it was about four thousand people who clicked on the link for this dress <laughs> and maybe half of those people actually bought this dress or bought something so it's nuts it's very very good if you don't if they don't have it in your size get on the waiting list because they're gonna remake this and luckily i was able to catch it on sale um all of these things i got from skims were on sale during during the memorial day sale but of course they have all gone back up to full price so sorry um, but yeah, this also comes with a matching silk robe. The robe was already sold out like by the by the time I checked out, I couldn't get the robe, but I love it. Um, in addition to this one, I also got it in, I think this color is called talc. It's like a beautiful, uh, almost like mossy, not, no, it's like a sage green but they call it talc and it just looks so beautiful against my skin. Again, I got the size small in this um, and it's just absolutely stunning. I've slept in this one as well. I'm probably gonna be living in these silk dresses all like summer long. Um, fortunately, I was able to get the matching robe for this set and it's so beautiful. It has pockets on the side. It has a large strap to tie around the waist on the inside it also has the two straps that you can tie together so that it doesn't open up and i mean i made a reel did i make a reel with this i did i actually posted it here on youtube as well so i made it a reel wearing this set um creating my favorite cup of coffee in the morning which is nespresso with oatly oat milk and a little bit of um irish cream from uh, from amazon um my favorite like oat milk latte i have to have one every morning so good but i made a reel of that and like it kind of went right viral and then of course so many people then went and bought this set it's quite pricey like i don't know if i would personally buy it if it wasn't on sale but uh the quality is amazing it's there um and in the robe i got a medium just because i like my robes to really be oversized and dramatic and sweeping um and this fit the bill okay i also got two more things from skims i got another house dress i have i think this is the soft jersey um house dress it's the in that ribbed knit very stretchy um very 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 long i'm five foot six and yes it does sweep the ground on me um but i got a small in this and i just wanted the heather gray color i also have this and like a very light pink color and then almost like a nudie light brown kind of khaki color as well um yeah but when i when i saw the heather i had to get the heather like 
it's amazing these dresses are great i wear them into the ground um the other two i have are currently in miami but lots of stretch again i size down i get the small instead of the medium fits great and of course the straps are adjustable which is wonderful um i'll link this dress down below and all of the others as well make sure to check out all of the links because sometimes i'll link directly to the product on like the skims website and other times i'll link to where you can actually buy it online other times i will link to where you can actually buy it online where it's in stock because i know this always sells out on the skims website so i'll always link others that are actually in stock that you can buy i believe at nordstrom every size every color they have in this dress is like currently available so i'll link them all down below head to the, the description box click on the links make your purchases help your girl out that does help me when you use my links um one more dress from skims and then i'll show you a few pieces i got in from meshki all right guys so here we have another house dress this one is a razorback tank style though it is also ribbed knit fairly stretchy i got this in a small um and i just like that this is a razorback instead of sh with straps just in case you want a little bit more coverage i thought this would be great for around the house it's very lightweight but has a good amount of stretch um of course you can also just wear this out <laughs> like outside with some sandals it's one of those just kind of throw on and not think too hard about it pieces i actually think this will look amazing paired with like a vintage style belt. I have a vintage Chanel belt that I think I'll pair this with and just like a nice easy breezy flat just for an everyday look. This one I actually did get in a size medium instead of a small and of course it's a little bit bigger on me um, but they didn't have it in a small and I really wanted the white so yeah. I'll link everything from skims down below for you guys now if you watch all my vlogs and you should be um for memorial day here in new york city i actually went to a brunch party called revive brunch it happens every year around memorial day it's like um a caribbean theme party soca music um super 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 fun my girl Gloria and I went and I wore this really sparkly dress. The theme of the party was sparkles. Um, so I wore this stunning like brown dress from Retrofit. I'll pop a little. I gotta, I gotta get on the next thing smoking. Back to Miami y'all. The New York noise, I hate it. Anywho, I'll pop a little photo or a video up of that sparkly brown dress and I'll link it down below. A lot of you loved that dress. Um, but the theme was sparkles and so I hit up Meshki to send me like some sparkly pieces. They didn't get here in time. Um, but I have to show you the two pieces from their, I believe it's called Mars Collection. Alright guys, so first up we have this two piece set from Meshki that comes with this sparkly like a bandeau top. It doesn't look like much on screen. There is like um, a nude mesh in the back, so it's not see-through. But you guys can see how colorful and sparkly it is. Absolute, oh, when I brought it away, you can see the sparkles. And then it has a matching uh, midi skirt that also has like a little string that kind of hangs out of your waist. Kind of giving the appearance of showing like an underwear but it's a very sparkly shiny matching skirt i wish this would have came in time i would have loved to wear this for the party but uh it is stunning i got a medium in the bottom and i got a medium in the top as well it fits really really great it's really fun if you're looking for something sparkly something that's going to get you seen um maybe for a beach party or a summer party or anything that requires sparkles definitely check this out i'll link it down below it's so cute i'm gonna find some place to wear this soon maybe in miami um for like a beach party or a boat party or something but absolutely love this so shout out to meshki for trying to help your girl out for that party 
Okay, one more piece from Meshki, another sparkly dress from the Mars collection. Um, this one is just like a tube mini dress. As you can see, it has those same beautiful like crystals that kind of sparkle in the light here. Um, this dress is a mini dress and you can kind of see where it hits on me, but it does come with underwear. <laughs> So everyone's not seeing your Kimball's and Bits. Yes, it comes with like high-waisted underwear and it does also come with a little top that you can wear underneath so nothing is showing. Um, I might actually wear this during maybe like Juneteenth. I don't know. We will see. We have, oh my gosh, you guys, for Juneteenth in New York City, there's so much going on. Oh, I cannot wait. It's going to be so fun. Of course, I'm going to vlog, so make sure you guys stay tuned. But yeah, this is the second piece from Meshki. Hopefully, I can find some place to wear this. All right, guys. Last but not least is actually a beauty product that I got from a brand from Laura Mercier. I love them, by the way. I use their eye um, caviar eye sticks, eyeshadows. Um, but that, but that, but they sent over the Amber Vanille Body Cream. This is some of my favorite body cream for summer. It smells incredible. It's super luxurious. Oh, so if you're looking for a good body cream for summer that just smells amazing, I'm going to link this down below for you guys and you can check it out. It's incredible. All right, guys, so that's all of the new and luxury um, high street pieces that I got for Memorial Day or just on my recent outing shopping with my girl, Janae of Hyla Lux. Um, everything I've shown you is linked down in the description box. Everything from Skims, from Meshki, um, my new shoes if I can find them, anything from Christopher John Rogers. Of course, these tops from Amazon, um, the body cream, everything is linked down below. I also know someone's gonna ask me about the two-piece skim set that I wore while shopping yesterday. <laughs> um, I will link that down below as well. Uh, it's a great set. You could just throw a blazer on, on top of it for errands if you wanna be more modest. Otherwise, it's just a great two-piece set for summer. Um, so I'll link that as well. Without further ado, what we're gonna do is rewind it back to last night when I was getting ready to head to an event with my girl Janae of Hilo Lux. We ended up going to an event with The Outnet, which is a wonderful place to shop for discounted designer and luxury pieces. I will literally go through the site and link a few of my favorite things from the outnet down in the description box. If you just wanna get a feel for what they have, um, I'll do that for you guys. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and rewind it back. I'm gonna let all that footage play um, and then we're gonna come back to present day. Hello everyone. So hopefully by now you're all caught up. Um, but I went ahead and decided to actually vlog this evening because it's gonna be too good not to vlog. I did a really quick face, uh, all of my normal skincare. Um, I used the Beauty Counter Tinted Dew um, Foundation. Well, not really foundation, it's Tinted Moisturizer. Um, I use color six and seven and it literally just it gets me right. The lip, of course, Fenty Unveil. I do love a matte lip. I love a brown lip or a red lip. And I just thought it would go great with this look. All of the makeup products are linked down below. Uh, I'm very excited. So Janae invited me to an event she's going to this evening with The Outnet. I actually love The Outnet. It's one of my favorite places to shop. Like in addition to like Farfetch, My Teresa, um, Louisa Via Roma, Essence, Forward, The Outnet. They're like the places I go for designer goods, especially when they're having sales. And The Outnet always has designer sales. Um, 
and just deeply discounted like past season items so if you like missed out on something you can probably find it there i put on this dress this is actually a dress from the brand garris for tim which is located in paris it is a black owned um business or african owned business um and I just love this dress. I don't wear it enough. I wore it once just to shoot it, but I actually have never worn it. But it is too good. The contrast stitching, the colors. I just think it's the perfect dress for the event tonight. Um, I'm pairing it with my um, Givenchy heels with the gold chain. You can find them at uh, the Webster. I think they have all sizes. I'll link that down below. I'll link this dress down below. I'm wearing the small. Um, it does have quite a bit of stretch, so yeah. You could probably go with your normal size or size down if you want it to be a little bit more form fitting. Um, and for the bag, I'm probably going to do my brown bamboo branded blacklit bag. And then I think I'll either put on my Louis Vuitton or Chanel earrings. So let me get myself together and I'll show you the full look. All right, guys. So I decided to go with these really cool spiral ball earrings. I'm, I'm not sure if they're Y Project or J.W. Anderson. I cannot remember, but I'm they're long gone. I've had these for like three years. Um, and then of course the Giambito Rossi heels. I mean the Givenchy heels. All right, and that is the dress. Let me show you a better look because it's so good. This orange contrast stitching is everything. It really gives you an hourglass figure. It is absolutely stunning all right and then of course for the shoes we have my new and Givenchy heels um you can find them at the webster go with your normal size i'm usually a us size 10 i got the 41 they fit great they are very very comfortable um i love these i've been wearing them non-stop as you guys probably have noticed but yeah i love this look i want to pick a fragrance with you guys let's get my bag together oops sorry about that and we will call an Uber and head on down to the Outnet event. And I think they're showing like their latest collection there too. So yeah. All right, guys. So now we're in my office, my office slash closet. All of it is Ikea. I need to pick a fragrance for this evening. I want to smell rich because I think we're going to Nobu for dinner afterwards. So... I've only been to Nobu here in New York City once and it was during fashion week. I feel like it was the last fashion week. I went with some friends. Um, so yeah, today we are going to go with Tay Noir 29. It's my favorite. It's very mysterious and not a lot of people know about it or wear it. Um, you can't put your finger on it really unless you've ever smelled it. So I like that. And it lasts all night. Um, it's from La Labo. Wonderful. I'm actually running so low y'all all right get some more um i'm gonna mix it with maybe like a spray or two of the baccarat rouge 540 rich rich smell <laughs> basically that's what that is just to lighten it up a bit because i find uh tay noir to be a little on the masculine side and then on my uh like pulse points i'm just gonna put a little bit of of the Bois d'Argent from Christian Dior. You guys remember I got this in a little sample. Um, I bought the Discovery set from Christian Dior that had like seven fragrances, a hand wash, a body wash, and a candle for like 200 bucks. And it was the best thing I ever done because I'm in love with this perfume now. I'm definitely gonna buy like the bigger version once this little one runs out. So yeah. Okay, and that are that's my scent for today the mixture of those three and of course i've already told you guys i'm taking my brand and blackwood bag i'm not going to use the body i mean the cross body strap or shoulder strap today um yeah i think it ties in nicely with my look i have my louis vuitton key holder here just kind of pop that in there i'm going to pop you guys in here as well as i'm gonna change the battery on you because you've you're probably gonna die soon. I'm gonna, um, well the camera is gonna probably die soon. I'm also gonna pop a little fragrance in here and then we are off. I mean, who would've thunk it? I literally was not gonna do nothing today, y'all. Like, y'all know how it is on the first day of your period. You don't leave the house. But, you know, your girl, she popped in the leave. 
had a glass of champagne while we were shopping today at YSL and I feel good. So let's go and have us a very New York City evening.
and we're back and i hope you guys enjoy coming to the outnet event with janae and i and also to nobu restaurant afterwards you guys soho grand that hotel is incredible that room i think it's a penthouse that they rented out and kind of decorated for the outnet event the view from the patio or from the balcony was absolutely breathtaking i mean you can see the empire state building it was just so lovely it was a wonderful event so shout out to the outnet for having me um hopefully we'll work together soon y'all know i love a discount um <laughs> and then we headed over to nobu i've been there once before but the food is incredible at nobu we went to the nobu in downtown manhattan there are a few locations but the downtown location is my personal favorite it's very sexy in there the vibes are immaculate the food everything was delicious so i hope you all enjoy seeing that footage as well and of course every place i went did all the things we saw <laughs> are down in the description box. So if you're heading to New York, um, you can check out the same places. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you stuck around this long, please do me a favor and click the thumbs up button. I would love to get 4,000 likes on this video. It helps to push my videos out to other people so that more people can discover your girl and come on over and subscribe. Um, and if you aren't yet subscribed, I would love for you to hit the subscribe button so that you never miss so that you never miss a video and you can keep up with me anytime I upload by clicking the notification bell. Again, everything is linked down below for you guys. Thank you for spending the day with your girl and I will see you all in the next one. Bye guys. <laughs>